and may the best play mat win. That's actually kind of tough. I don't know. Yeah, it is pretty tough. I guess. Uh, yours is pretty sweet. And it's a pretty sweet card. But yours is an awesome reference too. So I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> well, we'll find out. Stay tuned. So you see who goes first. I, if you don't mind, I would like to play poker. Poker? Yeah, I had to do that. Alright. That is show. I'm missing one. <laughs> just throw it into the ring. Okay. And just a pair of fives, high six. Okay. So, if you can beat that. Well. Pair of twos, high five. All right, I'll take the play. All right, you could have bamboozled me, and I wouldn't have known. <laughs> well, we're on camera, so <laughs> some of it. <laughs> uh, okay. Mm, it's risky. Mm, nope, well, it's not that risky. No land. Can't do it. <laughs> Easy enough. Five. This hand's okay if you're playing a slow deck. <coughs> Any deck is a slow deck when you mold a four. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. Oh, we'll, we'll see. The scry makes it. What were we about to say? I was about to say that. Red white decks, man. Man, you're not kidding. One mana. If I could just wreck your shit. So, no one has explained to me yet why red white has card advantage and card selection <laughs> out the wazoo right now. Oh, it's Dipala is the dwarf, right? Is that yeah. the name? Mm. Yeah. That's crazy. And then crazy. there's the three one that scries to you. Yeah, dude. That and then Raven Inspector. Well, yeah. And Smoker's Cup. Not a dwarf, but that's fine. You, you, that's that's fine. fine. A one, two for one that gives you an artifact for your other dwarves. Oh. Well, I... <laughs> yeah, we'll keep just a second. <laughs> Proceed to your turn. Okay. Got it. Right. Pass turn. I'm slow enough that I start off with a cinder glade tap. That helps. I'm gonna fetch for a blue and pass. Yep. Ulvenwald uh, captive. Ooh, one two defender. Werewolves. Ramps Werewolves, werewolves in London. Yeah, cool werewolves. There we go. Can't go wrong. I mean, eh. Yeah, you mean you oh, I'm sorry. You I'm could. holding you up here. No, you're good. Uh, I'll reveal. Okay. Oh, Hi, thing. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well. <laughs> I'll blow up your foreboding, foreboding ruins. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, we're that deck. Um, <laughs> past, <laughs> past turn. We're so that deck. A vital resource, man. Yeah, yeah, get those counters off it now. I'm sure you still can. <laughs> well, yeah, I've just kind of delayed. Don't pass. Okay. <laughs> Cinderglade tag untapped. Yeah. We got we got there. Yeah. We got there. Um, we'll reclaim your island. Even past turn. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Says the land destruction player. <laughs> I said. There can't be this many of those spells in standard right now. <laughs> These are functional reprints. I have eight. <laughs> I have eight. What the fuck? I know, it's dumb. Pass turn. I'll pass. Oh, Lord. Girl. <laughs> Note to self hit the mountain. <laughs> Nope, we're doing it anyway. I'm gonna anticipate. <laughs> okay, that's fair. Uh, <laughs> uh, exile. Exile. Not that it matters that much, but you know. Oh no, an anticipate's fine. The island is exile. Oh, the island is exile. Yeah. Why did I just think of it? It, it happens, dude. We get notes, force of habits. Yeah. 
Risky playing this tab. Oh, it's just a oh no! <laughs> but double. Oh, do it. Do it. <laughs> oh, by the way, did you remove the camera? You're right, right, right. I missed the trigger. It's all good. We're. <laughs> this is F and M. <laughs> yeah. You know, he says that, and then you know what he top decks. Um, it's pleasant. We are going to do this. We're going to make sure we play this correctly. Collective Defiance. We're going to use all three modes. The first mode is going to target myself, so I'll discard all one card in hand and then yeah. draw a card. I had a fear that that wasn't recording. Yeah. All right. Then, uh, four damage to you yep. and three damage to your face. All right. Specifically your face. All right. Well, <laughs> all right. <laughs> Sorry. And then, uh... <coughs> I can't attack! Pass turn. Why am I 15? Uh, two from Structural Distortion, three from... Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm with you. I'm with you. Yeah, it's weird. Land Destruction that deals damage. Molten Rain. Get wrecked. Oh. I'll live fast, draw two, lose two, two energy. Fair enough. I don't have an energy on me. I, well, I'll just keep it. That, that works. Draw will pass. You're something... Oh. Hollow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> How many... This is like... Well, Four lands? Five lands you've destroyed? Yeah, I think so. Pastor, you, I have not see, been able to keep more than Five lands, yes, yeah. exactly. That's incredible. Uh, <laughs> I'll pass. <laughs> this is not working out for me. Yes. Uh, okay, and that's fair. It's gonna go away. Into another land. The one time when you want to see the land. <laughs> All right. No, your your deck is the kind of deck that can get out of this lock. Lock. Maybe. I don't know, but it can't keep land. <laughs> Tormenting void. Oh no, cathartic reunion. Maybe both. Uh, I'll reveal. Oh, okay, okay. It's like all my blues. I'll live fast I'm again. Blue. Yep. Roll you up to four. Uh, I'm gonna replace this if you don't mind, just so yeah, it's easier it, to dude. see. All right, he's at four energy. And I'll pass. <laughs> All right, let's uh, see. You got one. Find number seven. I'm gonna see if I can. Yeah. Significant amount of blue. Will pass. He didn't get there. Interesting. Unfortunately, that's, that's a high concentration of blue out of my deck. Yeah. It's gonna come for me. I got a feeling you won't be casting Sphinx of the Final Word anytime soon. <laughs> um, I'll pass. Pass. Draw, go, draw, go. Hang on. I just realized that my end step I had too many cards. Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Take, do your thing. Do what you gotta do. Yeah, I'll discard a Void Shatter. Okay. And then. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Void Shatter. Rip Void Shatter. Uh, I'll eat it. I'll get a fifth energy. Okay, that's fine. Oh, pass. It's kind of blue. Oh my god. Please don't go. Pass. I'm nervous. If you could see my hand. Rip and pepperoni. I have gotten to that part where I have run out of gas. That stage in the game. Okay. Well, reclaiming vines, the Aether Hub. Anticipate? I don't blame you. I don't have to use energy. Okay. Negate it. Negate? Fair enough. Pastor? I gotta make you use it. He do. Um, I'll pass the turn. Oh my god. Pass turn. Oh, I got energy. Good thing, I'll pass. Okay. Last thing I ever 
Yeah, I'm, I'm that was thinking. Uh, yeah, okay. I'm with you. Hmm. Oh, that would be interesting. May I, so it's a 7 8 on the reverse side. Yes, it is. Structural distortion, your aether hub. You'll take a two. Exile. Ooh, yep. And then. Faster. I think it whether or not you don't seem to be playing new creatures. How tough is this? It's just a one-two. You know, you can kill it. Kill it with fire. I'll destroy one of your lands in a way. I mean, yeah, that's yeah. fair. Float green. Sure. Die. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you're good. Trigger this. Draw. I guess it's still the technically correct thing to float, regardless. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, I'll pass. Okay. <laughs> the turn after... I'll play the Evolving Wilds. Yeah. Okay. Rip in peace, my nigga. Oh no, I can't do both! <gasps> oh! It's fine. Okay, so one of them, and then I literally don't have enough for the other, so we'll just incendiary flow it. Exile. Okay, sorry. And then I'll fetch while you're taking your turn, if you don't mind. Yeah, go for it. And then My turn will probably just be passing the turn. Probably. Actually, I have to move to discard. And get rid of it. So, fun fact, you have a, you know a card in my hand at least. There's that. There's that. I mean, not that there's much you can do to play around it, and uh... Not that it's a card on this, I'm like incredibly concerned with it. Yeah, that's true. Running cards like the There's no Pyromancer running around in this format. I just play it. Okay, okay, we got there. World Breaker, Ooh, tap everything, shit. sack Sanctum of Hogan. Ooh, you're gonna stack another World Breaker or probably something worse? And I will. Exile target, so, you're gonna get a land. Yeah, yeah, you know how this. I'll let you. Yeah, yeah I'm okay. With you. So when I cast the colors, I can do stack these in either order. <coughs> yeah, when I cast a colors spell with CMC 7 or greater, hey, Devoid, I can go and get another one. Yep. Um, and so I'll go and get a World Breaker, and this one will take out. We're gonna exile. It seems to make the most sense to hit the Foreboding Ruins, but on the off chance that I hit a certain card in this deck, I maybe should hit something else. <laughs> but and there's a world breaker by yep. the way we're gonna yeah we're gonna hit <laughs> may I see your graveyard yeah go for it okay there's number one it was the first one I hit okay we're gonna hit the foreboding ruins exile it uh, I guess that's true I think I'm licensed for this in response. Uh, okay. Dead. Super dead. Yeah. Well, I guess you could bring it, but well, you don't need to call this. Okay. Mm -hmm. Not at the moment. I'm going to figure out how I'm going to stack my graveyard here, and then I'll, <laughs> I'll pass the turn. I'm tapped out. Super tapped out. Uh, it would be good if I had man. Best turn. Okay. Now, what is this a May or? Oh no, it's you May. Okay, it's the Coslex return that was in the graveyard. I needed to make sure of that. Uh, Death Cap Cultivator. And pass turn. And by the way, creature land sorcery instant. It is delirium. So it has death touch. Yeah, that's all. Not not much, but it's it's a thing. Four breakers toughness is seven. Yes, it is. All right. Uh, let's just pray. Draw one. Draw one. It's all right. I'll pass. Okay. Well, I mean, you know what's gonna happen then. We're gonna tap the lot. Yep. We're gonna world breaker. Yep. And world breaker's gonna exile swamp. Want to float some mana? Uh, I guess, but it's not I, I mean, you gotta hold up that disintegration anyway, yeah. just in case. That's true. And then, um, 
will pass the turn. Much less I can do. Uh oh. I'm gonna do three to it with this because there's one already in the graveyard. Oh, here we go. Well, you have four to it, right? It's two it's times the number? No, well. It's X two. Is then, two plus the number. Oh, yeah. two plus, not two times. Yeah. Okay. So it's two plus one. So. Yeah. My bad. And then I I'll didn't get that. Deal four to it, getting four ener three energy. I'll go down to two yep. energy. World Breaker be dead. Okay. You got it. All right. I mean, I don't know, man. I don't know if we're able to come back out of this. One, two, three, four, five, you, six, you're, seven, you're putting yeah. up a valiant effort, man. I'm trying. I'm gonna pass. I've ever told you that you have the most fabulous hair of any magic player in the world. Okay, so. World Breaker. Oh my gosh, the place uh, we'll, we'll hit. Uh, I love RTR, but these kind of match. No, we're going to hit this one. <laughs> Specifically that one. Uh, uh oh. I'm trying to think. There's probably a smart way to do this. Harness Lightning, the Cultivator. Yeah, I'll do the green. Yeah. green. It's dead. <laughs> yeah. So, so you net two. Yeah, you're right. Four. Uh, yeah, uh, and then, uh, pass turn. I was hoping I could get two in somewhere. Two red. Love you, red. Uh, I'm being that guy, and I know it, and I'm sorry. You're good. They say land destruction is not viable right now. Yeah, you were like, well, what's Pyromancer's goggle rotates? I don't know. <laughs> I, I wasn't sure, and then they re they printed reclaiming vines and or uh, not re creeping creeping mold, and they reprinted demolish. And then yeah, swing five. Use all my energy to kill it. Uh, don't you only have- Oh my goodness, you make- Oh my god! Okay, that's the thing. <laughs> Wrecked. <laughs> Wrecked. Uh, pass turn. Oh boy. <laughs> Wrecked. Hey, T1 actually. Glistener wreck. I'll pass. Uh, end of turn. <gasps> no colorless mana at this time. Uh oh, uh oh. It's gotta specifically be colorless. Alright, Sanctum, where are you at? <laughs> okay. Okay. Cultivator? <laughs> and then, pass turn. Okay. Swing? Mm, maybe. Okay. Pass turn? Uh oh. What is it? Oh, Glimmer. Uh oh. I feel the comeback. <sighs> I feel the comeback. Yeah, he's a 6 Uh-oh. All that blue man I've been working to get rid of. Void Shatter online. And no black man, that's convenient. Mm -hmm. I don't see myself getting mm, much more value out of this card. So, I like to put do it on. I don't have Brady and Flames. I need to get cards out of my hand. Yep. I'll pass. That's fair. That's a good enough reason, I would think. Pass turn? Thing. Yep. Yep. Okay. I'll pass. Return. Flow. Pass turn. Yeah, 
pass the turn. Oh, I'm going to grab two pass. I'm going to lock late one. Chandra. Oh, boy. Oh, man. Um, Void shatter. If only I had discarded the wall. Well, not all of them. Yeah, I guess that's not the kind of card you'd have as a four out of four, perhaps. Yeah. Well, oh, let's just look here. Let's just look here. Oh, how many cards are we going to have? It's going to result in a four. Uh, zero. Discard all the cards in my hand. Draw that many plus one. Okay. Alright. Reasonable. Ulvenwald captive. That's all. Okay. And, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure you would have used a counter spell if you had it on the Chandra. Yeah. Uh, past turn, I'm getting up my die for, uh, yeah. Chandra. Just to make sure. She's at her standard, but just to be on the safe side. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, I'm glad Dreadbore is not in the format right now. <laughs> I know, right? Didn't that seem a pretty good bit of... No, it didn't, because it wasn't in uh, Esper Control or any of the decks that beat Esper Control. Alright, I'm going to hand this over I'm trying not to see your hand. Oh, is it visible? Uh, you, were, you were leaning it forward, I'm sorry. Right, no. I'll be on the board. Now I actually got to be smart about my they discard. Playing before that. Oh. They playing in, uh, well, I'm at such a low level. Oh, so oh, really? And I don't think. Oh my gosh, I might lose next turn. You see, I have the kill on board. Yeah, I do. That's what I just said. Exactly said. But, no, there's a possibility. It's a 4 6 that makes. Yeah, yeah, check it out. It's a 4 6 that makes double colorless. No other abilities. That's what I was checking to make sure. No vigilance or anything. Discard the fast and pass the turn. Okay. So there's the play at safe route, and there's the go for the kill this turn route. Go for the kill this turn is transferred, transform Ulvenwall captive now or in beginning of combat, and make two three ones, and that gives me lethal on board. The safer play is hold up Ulvenwall Captive's Transform until the end of my opponent's turn so that I can hold up what I have in hand, but then I'd probably be using... Uh, I think I still probably plus John. Get her up to five. I'd have to discard all the cards in my hand. Um, I think it's better if I plus. I actually do have the two around here somewhere. Alright, hey! Transform ability on the stack? Sure. Okay. Cool. Yeah, we'll just do it all the way. I'm just gonna just let it hang out a little bit. <coughs> no, we're good. I'd like to go to combat. Okay. Um, I'm gonna have to use an injury. Okay. So, Hulk. Shenanigans. Uh oh. I'm gonna have to disintegrate this. It has been. In response, I'll float double colorless. Sure. For a reason. I don't want to play the zero mana four six. It makes two mana. Um, nope, we're good. And then uh, swing. Go to one. Flow? I'm dead. Alright, alright. I didn't see it's in her room. I probably should have. I probably should have let you attack before I killed it. I gotcha. 
So I, well, that's a sorcery anyway, so I had to do that after damage resolved, regardless. Yeah, well, I guess it doesn't really matter. Well, yeah, you're right. Yeah. It, it's all good. So, just <laughs> that happened. Yeah, that happened. That happened big time. Whoa. We've been shoving for way yeah. too long. We've been talking about Hearthstone and just, just chilling, <laughs> just having a good weekend. <laughs> All right, man. So I take it you'll be on the play? Yep. Okay. When I'm playing the... Against you, I think I'd probably still want to be on the play, but sometimes I might want to be on the draw, depending on... I mean, it gets slower next. I feel confident being on the yeah. play, but I feel like by the time I'll be able to play a land, you will kill it. And this hand's like... Yeah, it's, I like it. I'll keep it. Um... I think this is better than an average six, but I'm taking a, a stupid risk by doing this. So, so I'll totally get punished for it. Um, we're gonna we're gonna go. All right, all Wilds. All right. Four. You can go ahead and go. I'm just okay. I'll get the uh, evolving wilds. I'll get nothing. Nothing. Pass turn. Ooh. Withholding information from your opponent. Yes, smart right here. Well, there's also another potential reason, and I'll show you in a, in a sec. Okay. I'll explain it in a sec. They, I'm not just being. I'm not. I'm not trying to. Well, there's a thing. Sorry. <laughs> Literally. Uh, I'm not trying to be rude. I, I do have a reason. No, that's pretty good. I mean, I understand. Like, this is probably the same reason people like crack fetches on their opponent's turn and stuff like that. Like advanced strategies. Well, well, I might not crack it at the end of the turn, is oh, the, okay. the trick here. I might not crack it. Alright, well, I'm gonna fetch four. Uh, pretty set on curves, I think. So I'm just gonna grab a blue and pass. <laughs> well. I wouldn't really go that loud because I don't really care. We're not cracking it. We're gonna draw. Okay. Again, I swear I have a reason. I believe you. The reason is because I wanted to make it more likely I would draw lands later no. on. And if I thin, I'm less likely. It's a m small margin, but it's potentially real. Two guys. Playing this a while longer than I have. Pass turn. Now we'll fetch. All right. Sure. Works out. That's good. Uh. I'll transgress the mind. Ooh. Um, well, you won't be too disappointed. The ones you can get, say hi, and then the ones you can't get. Bunch of ramp. So, this is why I kept. I have three yeah. land creatures, but I have one land in the opener. But on the draw, I get two chances at it. Yeah. And thankfully, I, I got there with Evolving Wilds. Uh, but yeah, so two land destruction spells, and... World Breaker. And I'm, so all three land destruction spells. Oh, I think it's all of them? That hits all instances. So if you have four Spire Bluff Canal, mm. probably probably take the Crumble to Dust. Yeah. <laughs> and it's exiled. Yep. I like the way you do it, where you put it under your graveyard. I'll yeah. play Reveal, by the way. You can still do you want to. I mean, it's I remember the relevant cards. <laughs> That's turn. Yep, yeah, take go it. For it. Yep. Well, this one's this, but I'm going to be. Oh my god. <laughs> yep. Pass turn. Fetch. Mountain. Mountain. There's not much of a reason for Hedron Crawler in this deck, but one potential reason why I might want it is it can pay for World Breaker's ability. It is true. Do you have any colorless sources to pay for World Breaker's ability? Other than like Sanctum and one more card you haven't seen yet. Okay. Well, Sanctum is usually getting sacked to find more World Breakers, right? That's right. Usually. I can, hopefully, if I have enough room, I can float mana in response, but that rarely matters. <laughs> 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 
Let's begin. Spire Bluff, it's your only red source. Oh my god. Oh, oh it's super dead. Super. It's a very technical term. Super dead. Super dead. All right. Does Fire Bluff get yeah, dead? Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, it's, it's, it's uh, super dead. All right. And then uh, where we pass are. turn. That shit. Yeah. Um, I'll reveal for... My goodness. Oh, my goodness. That means... And another red source. And I'll pass turn. Okay. <laughs> you know, there's no chance. No chance. All right. That's doing what a spider should do. probably And then everybody's like, So, obviously, just jam two ramp creatures and then go for the next turn well breaker, maybe? Is that the right thing here? I know you can hold, you're holding up Glimmer potentially. It's instant four mana. Just do it! <laughs> You've seen that video, right? Yes. Pass turn. In a tournament, a harness. The smaller one to get more energy. Uh, the smaller one? Yeah, yeah, that's, that's fair. That makes sense. More energy, you say? Dos, senor. Yep. At the end of the sword, by the way. At the very end of the sword. <laughs> Just the tip. Hello. <laughs> I'll pass. All right, top deck of land. Top deck and untapped land. Hey! And it's colorless. Stupid luck. Um, insert world breaker here. Okay. Uh, just to make sure I still get the ability, I assume. Because it's when you cast. Is that when you cast? Is that when yeah, you cast? You'll, you'll still exile the world breaker, but I'll still get to yeah, yeah, hit one that's land. Probably still smart. Um, it's also a creature that's pretty big. Yeah, no, no, that's still right to do, because now I can't get it back. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, I guess you do still get your pick on it. Three black sources, three blue sources, two red sources. But I haven't seen anything that uses red, red, and I don't think I will with the possible exception of Collective Defiance. So it might... <laughs> <coughs> oh man! Don't 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 hint, don't give me a hint. I need to learn. Figure it out. I'm trying to think of what your deck list looks like. It's got to be one of the two color ones, obviously, but that doesn't narrow it down too much. That still gives me three guilds. <laughs> Just the fact that Foreboding Ruins is untapped right now could mean something, but I'm trying to think of what one mana instant speed black or red cards would be relevant here. One mana. Not right here. Galvanic Bombardment. Well, even even if I hit bombard, even if I hit this because of bombardment, you can still tap in response. So I think we still got to take the Spire Bluff Canal, exile it, uh, World Breaker be dead, be exiled, and rip and pepperoni. Pass turn. That was actually smart because I can do a lot more in one turn with blue. I believe you. Blue and well, no, no, I'm not. only Stupid. having two red sources. Also, kind of. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> It's actually, if you think that I'm going to have the crumble to dust, getting it out of your hand is a good thing because I can't take it if it's on the field. Um, oops, a little late, bro. A little late. I don't think we really have. I have two cards in my hand. It's not a whole lot of cards. No? No, it's not. I don't know. I do uh, uh, reclaiming vines. 
It's got to be the sunken hall. In response, boy, shatter, negate. Yeah, negate. Okay. That negate? The oath negate? No, it's fine. I, guess, I don't know. No, I'm just messing with you. I'm just messing with you. Pass turn. Pass turn. Okay. Deck thinning. What's so wrong with that? Well, yeah, I guess it's not that cool. I don't know what other names are. I'm just, I'm just messing with you. That's all. It's not my personal preference. I like the the old Lorwyn block one with a circle uh, yeah. that sort of like goes along the thing. Uh, it's like a his back, I guess. I'm not sure exactly. Anyway, <laughs> anyway. <laughs> I will pass the turn. Yeah. Good luck shuffle. Schwamp. I'll pass the turn. End of turn. Make a dude. From Westville Abbey. Oh, yeah. So see, one, yep. two, three, four, five. So, and then the dude itself. Yeah. Dude Arena. Um, doink. Um, now, that being the case, I did not bring any cleric tokens. I don't have any. It's all right. All right. I'm with you. I know what it represents. Anything in the turn now? I just realized a mistake. But I didn't expect it in this village. You keep throwing me off guard with your cards. Yes! It's so hard. I'm doing my job. I'm doing my job. So, we can get a big creature out that you can't counter if we play this correctly. Do I want to pay seven now, or do I want to keep... Yeah, we, we do it now. We do it now. Big. Roar! Oh shit, forgot that. Yeah. You do that. Why you no know counter? Because you can't. I mean, I guess disallow will be. Yeah, yeah, I was about to say, there's the new one. Disallow. I'll swing I five. probably would have disallowed that, Rock. actually. Oh, by the way, I'm at 19. Yes, yeah. pay yeah. one. Sorry, YouTube, sorry. Comments. Why? <laughs> Where did I hit you for four earlier? Well, did you not just swing five? Oh, oh, you're doing it now. Sorry. Okay. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I, I hit myself down to 19. You, I'm getting confuzzled. I keep forgetting. I'm getting well, I keep forgetting it's there. Yeah, it's good. You're good. All right, and then, pass turn. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking die. <laughs> It's a very technical. I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna pass the turn. I'm not even talking about the game anymore. I'm gonna physically die. <laughs> and the cancer I'm getting from these cards. What the hell? Um, because it's the second one's gonna flip, yeah. They can't do anything. Alright, that's like what? That's eight, it's nine, nine coming yeah. at you. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Pass turn. Well, if you can deal with one of them, you've got another turn. No, I can't. I'm losing. Rejection! Oh my god. Yeah, that's a thing. Uh, if you knew my deck list better, I don't think you would have brought those in. Worldbreaker is the only colorless card in the deck. Well, I, I noticed like Worldbreaker crumble to dust. Crumble is, but yeah, that's and right. Crumble is too. Now Kozla, oh, I only brought one extra one in. I just happened to draw both of them. Wow. Okay, let me rephrase. The only relevant card, although Crumble is Crumble still relevant. You're right. I don't know that Kozla's return is, but I took out two Kozla's return and still had one in the list. Just I couldn't find. <laughs> Galvanic Bombardment I don't bring in unless I'm bringing in all four, and that was really... So... Yay! I took out Radiant Flames because like, I'm just not getting enough value out of it, but then Westville got me came up, and I'm like, if I don't deal with those tokens... It's a singleton, so I don't blame you, dude. It's a singleton Westville. So we'll see I, I would have known that. Yeah. I'm supposed to have one more Sanctum of Ugin in the list, in which case it'll be four Sanctums and a Westville Abbey. Uh, and Westville Abbey, born and raised. Yeah. I'm sure that joke's been made before. <laughs> Um, yeah, so that's the sideboard for me. I brought in two Crumble to Dust and I took out two Coslex returns. Um, Crumble to Dust seems good in the control match. 
And that's that's really it. Uh, the only other card I was considering, Galvanic Bombardment, but unless I get two of them, I don't really get any value out of it, right? Because Thing, and that's... Oh, do you have any creatures other than Thing? Torrential. Torrential. Oh, God. Well, I'm glad I didn't bring that in. And the other one was uh, Thermo Alchemist. But this is not this is not the right match for Thermal Alchemist at all. That's for I need to block your vampires and your artifact dudes. So definitely not right. But there we go. That's it. <clears throat> GG's bruh. GG's. Mm -hmm.